Hello, my dear students. This is Zine Abdullah, your IT teacher. Welcome you in our second video for our second week, which is January 14th to January 18th. In this week, we will continue with more skills and topics to cover the data analytics module, where we are going to learn more about extracting values using text function. Text function is one of the function which we use it in advanced spreadsheet. But this in this module, we will learn how to implement this module, oh sorry, this function to extract values using the text functions like trim, left, right, concatenate, and more. Also, we'll go more with filtering data sets by format data sets as a table and use table slicer. Table slicer is something in new. You will learn how to use it and how to format the data and show it in different way, uh, in different ways, actually using the table slicer. Also, we will start with changing aggregation methods where we will use the pivot table. Pivot table also we cover it before as one of the Microsoft Excel tool, which will help us to summarize the data and show the information in different way to read it in easier way. And pivot table, one of the important tools we can use it to analyze and summarize large data set. And at the same time, we can apply calculations using pivot table, like using sum function, average function, max and min, so we can summarize the data, analyze it, and apply calculation to the summarized data using the pivot table. Of course, you will find more videos, tutorials, activities within this class. We will continue with aggregation, but with using multiple aggregation value using also pivot table, where we can summarize the data using more than one value or more than one field uh, within our data sets to apply more uh, skills analyzing uh, on our information. In our last lesson this week, we will use built-in calculation using pivot table where we will focus more on using for calculations. Of course, with applying calculations, you can format the data as number, with this currency, control the number of decimal places and more. Uh, you will find all of that with our uh, pivot table fields. As you know, you can show the data within rows and columns and apply calculations in between to show the data, summarized, organized, and show the numbers we need uh, in order to understand more the data. My dear student, this was uh, a quick summary for our second week for uh, advanced ICDL course data analytics module. Thank you for paying attention. If you have any questions, just refer to me anytime.